What's happening is Len Davis with Pangeality Productions, and we're here in Seattle, Washington. I'm with my copiloto and main sidekick, Zuli D. And we're here with a bunch of goats underneath the University Bridge. That's I-5, the interstate, that goes all the way from San Diego to Vancouver, or Tijuana for that matter. And in our neighborhood here, this temporary fence has been installed under this massive interstate freeway. And these goats, even though they're chilling right now, are here because they eat back crazy brush. And they get where it's hard for people and uh, machinery to get to. Some of the reasons it says here, they eat a huge variety of vegetation. They sterilize weed seed in their digestive process. They love brambles, including stickers. They're about as eco-friendly as you can get. They eat the invasive species in enormous amounts of biomass, and they're extremely cost-effective. They're loved and cared for. Most of them have been rescued. They have names. They have people watching over them all day. And what they can't eat, they are supplemented with love, hay, water, and salt. Amazing. So if we just cruise down here and see further down, there they are on the salt lick. And they're just here. Two salt licks. So pretty amazing. They're just scattered in the trees here. So many of them. What if there's so much until the end of the fence? I think there is. So Len Davis with Pangeality Productions. We're here in Seattle checking out the rent a ruminoid. These goats who are brought in every year to chow back all the overgrowth here. I'm with my main man, Zuli D. And uh, pretty amazing, cost-effective and totally natural way to manage this kind of difficult to access space under an in internet, uh, interstate freeway. It's about 40 to 60 goats. So fresh, loving it. All right. Peace. 40 to 60 goats in the middle of the city?